what what's the light at the end of the tunnel right right i'm incredibly scrappy and that word has been used to describe me ever since i was a kid and i never knew what it meant even when people were saying it to me in high school and it means i'm incredibly resilient and perseverant and I think because of the hardships I went through growing up, I made it my goal for no one else to be alone in those hardships, whether they be similar or not, in what they're experiencing. And a lot of people going through any type of legal issue, no matter who they are, even though it's not the type of law I want to do, like corporations, there is an incredibly isolating experience. You're going through something that you don't have the expertise in and it could have lifelong, sometimes even life or death consequences. And nobody should have to go through that alone. Nobody should have to figure that out on their own. I believe nobody should have to represent themselves in court, no matter what the situation is, I think. All tenants should have, you know, the right to, you know, a public defender like criminal, um, criminal cases do. So I really want to change the system and advocate for people without a voice. And I think the highest form of advocacy is lawyering in the courtroom and changing somebody's life and making that decision or that outcome even just a little bit less scary, even if it's not the outcome that they desired. Even if I don't win in a courtroom, even if I don't achieve the client's goals because of something else, I'm right there with them and that doesn't mean my job is done. It means I am there with them through every step of the way. And a lot of people don't approach lawyering like that. And I'm doing this for my family as well. I'm gonna be the first person with a doctorate degree in my family and first lawyer in my family. So I'm building a legacy for women, former foster youth and queer people that came before me and that'll come after me. So that is why I'm here doing what I'm doing, working full time in law school in the evenings. <laughs>